superb paid maximum with Christoph scoring paid 13 and Martin Dugar the guest scored 11 from four rides and with a guest the following week was Mark Lorem in for Tony and this was a tough match against Coventry the scores are levels we're coming to heat number nine and this one was probably saw one of the races of the season the last and a paid win for the Bullet off gate three Christoph Sigalski paid win and then a, a, a rare last in his next outing and on the outside it is Sean Tacey who started off very well indeed five points from his first two rides including that win with Billy behind him in heat number six so race number nine then it's just about underway Frank Hampton releases the tapes into that first corner and when it is last going to stand that leads away but he's been bossed aside there by Billy Hamill on the inside and Sean Tacey's come round in the second place Christoph Sigalski well now he's moved into third to last going to stand where he made a pretty good gate but now he finds himself at the back a yeah, split second error can cost you dearly in the elite league as Sigalski well he's going to have to try and overtake this team riding pair once more Hamill staying on that inside line Sean Tacey on the outer it worked very well for the Coventry Nick Well Toyota B's pairing in heat number six. Are they going to get a repeat? 5 1 in heat number nine. Sigalski, when he keeps going out wide, but there's just no way past at the moment. The Coventry riders are riding extremely well. Sigalski having a shut off, that is the first bend. He is Hamill on the inside, Sean Tacey on the outer. But Sigalski, well, can he make a desperate attempt around the outside? He's going full throttle. And here he comes, the crowd are cheering, and what a move this is. And in fact, Sigalski, well, he may have got up right on the line. Well, that was absolutely amazing stuff. The crowd, well, they have got absolutely mad. I think he's got it. Christoph Sigalski will ride by him. We all can go wide and far, but you will not see a better race than that anywhere. Better finish than that anywhere this year. That really was quite amazing speedway. Christoph Sigalski, well, where on earth did he get that speed from? Off the final bend, he found a way not past world number two, Billy Hamill, but also Sean Tacey was leading the race, and he got the victory, I'm sure, right on the line. Everyone thinks so. And, well, we must take another look at this. Absolutely fantastic finish to Heat. Now we've seen some high-class speedway here this evening, of that there's no doubt. You can see Tacey leading the way. But well, here comes Christoph around the outside of Hamill and around the outside just of Tacey. That really was quite brilliant. And well, we'll even take one more look at it in slow motion. See again and marvel at the skills and guts and courage of this Polish rider. And well, just, there's the slightest of gaps there, but we can 